this is Charlie Stocker. Hey Garden Guy, Charlie Stocker on Facebook, on YouTube, and HeyGardenGuy.com on our website where you can ask questions, submit them, we'll answer them within a day. Actually, we answer them in about eight to nine hours at the most. And then uh, you can have your questions answered and then possibly not make mistakes that you would normally make in the garden. We raise our IQ uh, one question at a time, and we all do it, myself included. I uh, have a question here. We're starting to go over a lot of the questions that people have sent, and it goes like this. Hey, Charlie, last fall you mentioned a new variety of boxwood, I think, in parentheses, that stayed small. What was that, and where can I get it? All right, here is the plant that I was talking about, but it's not necessarily new. This is my go-to, my favorite boxwood. And I say that because it, uh, it goes through the freezes fine. It's, it's uh, for zone six, seven, and even three, four, and five, it will do well. Was it damaged at all through the winter that we had this past year? But what I like about it even more so is that you don't have to trim it and it stays small. This is called a green velvet boxwood. And in some of our videos in the past when we're talking about planting, we say the number one consideration, if we were to just digest everything down and, and give you five things that we think are the most important things when you're getting ready to plant, the very first thing would be the right plant in the right place. So many of us, think that whatever size plant we buy, wherever, that's the size it's going to stay, when in fact that's not true at all. But with the boxwood, it stays about, it gets to about three foot tall, and I've had four or five in the front of my house now for seven years, and I've trimmed them one time, and they're just in front of some roses, tea roses that we have, but very, very little maintenance. We do the uh, worm castings, the blood meal, the bone meal in terms of enriching organically the soil around it. But for the most part, it, it's not a problem child. This green velvet boxwood stays small, little trimming, normal watering, and it's almost the right place for the right plant. This is Charlie Stocker, raising your garden IQ one question at a time. Have a great day.